Welcome back everyone, Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me today to this new episode of Music with Nick. We got a marathon lined up by Eric T. Thank you so much, Eric, for sponsoring this video. I do appreciate it. And thanks everybody for being here. Um, uh, I'm super excited. These bands I've never heard of uh, like ever. So I'm super excited. I have no idea what I'm getting into. So um, I'm happy. So um, without further ado, let's name the bands and let's get started. Um, let's see here. Uh, wow, that was quick. That was a quick intro. Um, so, uh, but yeah, here we go. <laughs> so the first band is going to be Bonobo. Bonobo and uh, chain uh, change down from dial M from monkey instead for murder. That's a cool kind of um, thing that they took from Hitchcock here from 2003. Cool. Bonobo. Then Scalpel. Scalpel. Scalpel, I guess. <laughs> Scalpel. Scalpel, flying officer from the band Confusion with a K, 2005. All right. This is going to be very interesting. Then Her Herbalizer, who is the realist? This is an instrumental version from the Herbalizer band, session one and two, 2009. Then Amon Tobin, uh, Hey Blondie, out from out from outwear okay uh 2002 so this is all newer stuff and then cosa or cosa but it's cosa which means thing in spanish nine lazy nine from sweet jones and this is from 2003 now let's see really quickly what um eric t this is called ninja tune marathon ninja tune all right uh, I would have added, you know, which is a ninja tune. Are you going to laugh? Um, ice. Uh, what was it? Ice. Vanilla Ice. Remember in the movie Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, The Secret of the Use. <laughs> what a bad movie. But um, the first one, I love the first Ninja Turtles movie. Um, but yeah, Ninja Tune Marathon. I don't know why. So let's pay attention to the lyrics. Here we go with the first one bonobo change down here we go so this is all new stuff i'm super excited and eric t just has very good taste when it comes to newer music prog whatever i'm always very very happy with your choices so let's go boom <laughs> it's very like new age i guess i mean it's it can't be new age because it's like 
from now, I mean, well, it's already 20 years old, but when I say 2003, I it still feels like, well, it's new, you know, <laughs> which is not. <laughs> but I love the, the bass line, the drumming, the whole vibe. It's very, like, ambient, you know, like, you could listen to this in the lounge, you know, just like, really cool music to improvise over. Maybe I should try it. Um, yeah. So let's keep going. I'm really digging this. Really cool. Sorry, if I'm doing something really quickly here, let me just do it while I'm with you guys here. Give me a second. Give me a second. Ah. Uh. Okay, let's just leave this. Um, I'm sorry, if I'm doing something like real quickly over there, uh, I apologize, but yeah, let's keep going. <laughs> this is improvised or if it's you know if they really wrote this you like that would be a cool thing to to read about but um this was amazing great drumming the bass the keyboards very hypnotic stuff really really good and also like i'm super surprised this has so many listeners like three mil almost four million monthly listeners so this is like you know doing you know the rounds this is really really good um give me just one second please all right i'm back thank you so much and um i yeah i do apologize like that i'm looking over sometimes there's stuff to do and uh but i'm usually gonna pause you know i don't want you guys to be like i'm like you know on the computer so i, I apologize so here we go with a, a scalpel you know, um, but I say scalpel because that's how you say it in German. But scalpel, flying officer, confusion. And there was this really cool movie. <clears throat> I think it was, <clears throat> sorry, from Poland called Control. 
and uh, it was like in the subways of I think Poland and it was Control with a K if you can watch that movie you can find it watch it it's amazing uh, I always want to rewatch that movie but I just I rented it one time I think from Blockbuster from like the um, art movie art um, like section and uh, and I've seen it I can look it up but I can't find it anywhere it's like a like an obscure movie but really really good like if you can't find it buy it okay here we go flying officer They just, they just like they play the you know the acoustic bass and then the electric bass like comes over and uh, it's very jazzy like drum and bass but also kind of like i like that there's like this you know like that sound that they laid over so it sounds like old man what a cool concept i love it Really good, and they're coming. They're actually on tour. Let's see where they are. Oh, in Poland. Only Poland for now. Wow. Really cool. I'm loving it. Really good. <laughs>
wow. This is some trippy stuff, man. I love it. This is right up my alley, but because I spend so much more time listening to instrumental music when I'm by myself, you know, I might even add something at the end, like a short Holtzworth tune or something, uh, because I think I can look them up under, because they're usually like eight minutes, 10 minutes. So there must be something shorter, but let's see if this goes too long. Um, then I don't want to overdo it, you know. Um, so, but this tune was really cool because it seemed almost like minimalistic, like on purpose, you know, like minimalism in like the jazz. I mean, they were like just playing notes. There was not real improvisation, but there was, you know, that sax, but just playing like these. I don't know, like the strip was like, but there was not really like improvisation, but it still works because everything they were doing with the keyboards, the chords was just good, man. Um, from Poland, um, really cool, totally different jazz, like, and then boom, 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 you know, oh man, so good. Um, Okay, next band. Um, uh, this is going to be Who's the Realist? Also an instrumental. And actually, Eric was very, like, he was like, please do the instrumental. I think there's one with lyrics, but we're going to listen to <clears throat> the instrumental. Here we go. <laughs> sounds like the intro to like a movie like remember that intro to fight club um uh, i don't know it just sounds really good i don't know it's just like it's almost like an intro to a movie or a show or i don't know something cool 
Something is about to go down. Um, this is great music. I'm loving it. Really, really good. It's extra shaky today. Look, I mean, I'm I'm literally just doing this with my leg, like, like I'm just following the beat, like, so sensitive. Look, I'm so sorry. Ah, uh, okay. Um, um. All right, so let's keep going. This was very, very good. Like I said, it sounded my, like I don't know, like like detective music uh, i don't know i can't, it just sounded very very good not detective music but it could be like a opener for a show or i don't know if i was a director i would use this for a scene something you know um really really cool okay so next one is amon amon or amon tobin and uh, this is uh, Hey Blondie. Here we go.
very trippy, very like out there, like electronic music. It says here, um, Amon Chabin's life and work in electronic music has produced some of the most important era defining records of this time and has helped to shape much of what has come since. So this is, I don't really know what kind of electronic music this is, you know, I'm, but I'm loving it. It's really, I wish it had some guitar. I mean, it had some guitar, I think even, uh, I think that was, those were keyboards, but I could totally see myself improvising over this very, very minimalistic, you know, not a lot of notes. You can, um, destroy something beautiful if you add too much you know um so this was very very cool very good like very like i said very loungy i'm sending all this stuff to alexia by the way um okay so last one is nine lazy nine cosa or cosa which means thing from uh sweet jones the album this is a longer song so here we go and i'm again sorry for the for the shaky camera but i'm just like really like i'm getting into it a lot of people like it i've, I've talked to people that that um that actually like when the camera shakes but some of you i know can can give you like motion sickness I'm, I, I do apologize for that so here we go <laughs> if you go to um meow wolf this is the music that's in the background super trippy you're like you feel like you're on a different planet um everyone should go there uh, meow wolf there's only one in denver here um and one in new mexico um and that that is like it's going in i i remember when i made a video um it's like being in a, on a different world and it's from the guys who uh, did Game of Thrones. He kind of designed the whole thing. So there's all these worlds and you travel by elevator and you come out and you're like, it's a trip. Like, look it up. And But literally the background music that you hear just being in this world is like, like very, very weird. Super good. Send it 
Wow. Crazy stuff, man. <laughs> oh man. Thank you, Eric. This is really good. Um I I'm not gonna compete try and compete with this. I'm not gonna ruin the set with any of my I was gonna do some liquid tension, but no, I don't know enough about electronic music. I'm just gonna mess it up. I'm gonna leave this like that. I think it's long enough as well. Um, if you just you know listen to it, um, I'm sorry if I didn't talk too much. This is really trippy. Um, I loved it. It was a great. This is a great marathon. I don't even know how what to call it. I don't know why you called it Ninja, a marathon. Please elaborate. <laughs> you know, um, uh, but this is freaking amazing. Really good music. I really loved it. Thank you so so much for giving me something new that I can, you know, just play and maybe, you know, like learn some new chords or some progressions. I'm doing a lot of programming as well, like with drums. Um, that was, I guess, the thing that I 
took me the longest to learn, you know, since I'm not a drummer. I do know about rhythm, but just the programming and all that crap. So, yeah, that's going good. But, hey, thank you so much, Eric. Guys, let me know. I'm sure not everyone has heard this before. I know a couple of people who's gonna, who are going to love this. And then I know a couple of people are going to not like this at all. Um, but the good thing is I loved it. Uh, Alexia's going to love it, too. So thank you so, so much for sharing this music because these are all amazing artists. They all have a, a massive following as well. This was particularly very, very crazy. Um, I would love to be like under the influence of something, um, <laughs> but I'm just like boring and I don't do anything. Um, so yeah, thank you so, so much for this. Um, thank you. For and also the other one, uh, let, let me just go back real quick. Um, have, have I released that one? No, but I'm gonna release it today. The Porcupine Tree, that marathon was beautiful. Actually, that one is going out right now as we're talking. Um, so so thank you, thank you so much for this, Eric. This was wonderful. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. If you like the video, if you like the channel, if you like you know, Alexia and, and my my work, please do subscribe to the channel. Um, most of the people that watch us are not subscribed. It does help us tremendously. Remember, it is free. Uh, Google or YouTube is not going to charge you anything if you subscribe to the channel. And you can also turn off notifications if they bug you. But if you want to, if you do miss videos or like, for example, when we announce like that we're going to go live or that we're going to do marathons or pictures then do turn them on so you get notified thank you so much for this this was awesome thank you eric thanks everyone for watching i'll see you in the next one